straight-tusked elephant. The straight-tusked elephant is an extinct species of elephant that inhabited Europe during the Middle and Late Pleistocene. It was formerly thought to be closely related to the living Asian elephant, however, in 2016, DNA sequence analysis showed that its closest extant relative is actually the African forest elephant, Loxodontus cyclotus, and in fact it is closer to L. cyclotus than L. cyclotus is to the African bush elephant, L. africana. Paleoloxodon antiquus was quite large, with individuals reaching 4 meters in height. One approximately 40-year-old male measured about 3.81 meters tall and weighed about 11.3 tons, while another from Montreal weighed about 15 tons and was about 4.2 meters tall. And had long, slightly upward curving tusks. P. antiquus's legs were slightly longer than those of modern elephants. This elephant is thought to have had an 80 cm long tongue that could be projected a short distance from the mouth to grasp leaves and grasses. With this tongue and a flexible trunk, straight-tusked elephants could graze or browse on Pleistocene foliage about 8 meters above ground. Some experts regard the larger Asian species Paleoloxodon nomoticus as a variant or subspecies. It was formerly thought to be closely related to the living Asian elephant, however, in 2016, DNA sequence analysis showed that its closest extant relative is actually the African forest elephant, Loxodontus cyclotus. It is closer to L. cyclotus than L. cyclotus is to the African bush elephant, L. africana thus invalidating the genus Loxodonta as currently recognized. Alternatively, Paleoloxodon antiquus might be more appropriately described as Loxodonta antiquus. Straight-tusked elephants probably lived in small herds of about 5 to 15 individuals. They preferred warm conditions and flourished in the interglacial periods during the current Ice Age, spreading from continental Europe to Great Britain during the warmer periods. It is assumed that they preferred wooded environments. During colder periods, the species may have migrated south. The straight-tusked elephant became extinct in Britain near the beginning of the Wakeselian glaciation, about 115,000 years ago. Finds of isolated tusks are relatively common in the United Kingdom. For example, a tusk of this elephant was found during the construction of the Swan Valley Community School in Swanscombe, Kent. However, finds of whole or partial skeletons of this elephant are very rare. Skeleton finds in the United Kingdom are known from only a few sites. Two sites were found in the Lower Thames Basin, one at Upner, Kent, and one at Avely, Essex. Paleontological and archaeological excavations in advance of high speed one revealed the 400,000-year-old skeleton of a straight-tusked elephant in the Ebbs Fleet Valley, near Swan's Coombe. It was lying at the edge of what would once have been a small lake. Flint tools lay scattered around, suggesting the elephant had been cut up by a tribe of the early humans around at the time, known as Homo heidelbergensis. On the European mainland, many remains of the straight-tusked elephant have been found. In addition to skeletons, some sites contained additional archaeological material, as in the Ebbs Fleet Valley. A skeleton at Laringen was found with the remains of a U-spear between its ribs and lithic artifacts around the head. In Greece, three partial skeletons have been recovered from the province of West Macedonia, and a Paleoloxodon antiquus butchering site has been excavated near Megalopolis, in the Peloponnese. Straight-tusked elephant remains have been found with flint tools at a number of other sites, such as Taralba and Eridos in Spain. Noter Chirico in Italy, and Graubern and Eringsdorf in Germany. A Paleolithic scratched figure of an elephant head in the Vermelhosa area, Portugal, near the COA Valley Park, is reported to be the depiction of an Paleoloxodon antiquus. The Iberian Peninsula may have served as the last European refuge of the straight tusked elephant. According to João Luis Cardoso, the species survived until 30,000 years BP in Portugal. Elephants that presumably evolved from the straight-tusked elephant are described from many Mediterranean islands, where they evolved into dwarfed elephants. The responsible factors for the dwarfing of island mammals are thought to be the reduction in food availability, predation, and competition.